brothers. It feels his opposition's been better than Margarito's. And he said the pressure's on Margarito. He's got the belt, not me. I think the key for Gomez is to get it off to a good start. You can't let Margarito take over. Margarito is usually a slow starter, so that's when you can take advantage of things. And that's what uh, Gomez is going to try to do in this fight. Gomez was well aware that he talked about a slow start. He just tagged him with two jabs. Tagged Margarito, the champ, who's in the black trunks. Now, now, Gil, is it me or does Margarito just look a lot bigger than most welterweights? No, he really does. He's a very, very big welterweight. Maybe he's got hollow bones. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's not any, the only time he ever tried to go up and wait, he went up to 154 and looked bad against Daniel Santos, his only loss in like the ni last nine years. So he doesn't want to do that again. Well, but he does want to take on the winner of Mayweather, Jab Judah. Beautiful left hook by Antonio Margarito. Oh, good right against... hand from Margarito. Whoa. Now he got tagged by a left by Gomez, who takes a good body shot from Margarito. You know, he's, he's got such a tough, aggressive style, Gil. How would you describe Margarito's style if you could compare him to any other fighter of today? Well, not comparing him so much of a fighter today, but from quite a few years ago, Gaspar Ortega. He looks, he does everything exactly the same as Gaspar. I thought I was looking at Gaspar when I saw some of the tape. <laughs> Round one, schedule 12. Your champion's in the black trunks. Good, solid shots exchanged so far. Gomez came to get business done early if he could. Right hand from Margarito once again snapped Gomez back. And the difference is that I think Margarito has more to his arsenal than Gomez does. Gomez depends on his right hand, although he's landing the left hook very well tonight. But Margarito's got a spectacular uppercut that he can land with either the right or left. Renato, you know, you mentioned his arsenal. It's a very, it's a very uh, peculiar style for me to describe Margarito because he's relentless. He puts a lot of pressure. He's very strong. He's hurt. Oh, good right hand. He's hurt. Down goes Gomez. He's out. He's out. He spits out his mouthpiece. And right here in front of us, Margarito takes care of business. And Gomez is upset. And you can't argue with the stoppage. That was a great stoppage by Richie no. Steele. And Gomez is violent. He's so upset. And Margarito is a force to be reckoned with in the welterweight division. And the mistake that Gomez made, Gil, if you would agree with us, he spit out.